Shuriken just released their Solana Telegram trading bot. They've kicked off season two, they've got points, and they've hinted at a blade token. Seasons, points, a hinted token, you know what that means, airdrop. So if you don't even trade meme coins on Solana, I do think this is a good opportunity, not financial advice, to qualify for something that I think is an uncrowded trade and then hopefully also make those 100x gains. Now look, down below there are chapters so you can fast forward to these sections that you want to get to the tutorial, all of that good stuff. Also, this is not financial advice, not a financial advisor. Please do your own research before moving on the space. Meme coins are very, very risky. Now a super quick overview, Shuriken, is a trading bot and platform. They've got an ETH platform that has been built out and they're building out the Solana platform. They've also got an ETH trading bot. But in this video, we're gonna speak about the Solana bot because this is what they've started for season two. And I feel like this works a little bit better with the reduction of gas fees and also the meme coins that are popping off on Solana. And although they haven't officially announced an airdrop, if you look at this promo here, you can see right at the end, um, dollar sign blade. So there is the blade token. Now, what they're doing to actually build up towards that airdrop with these different seasons is they're doing points and the points are called stars stars because the shuriken is a star so what you're doing here is you're essentially farming for points which are stars which will then convert to a blade token later on so that's everything kind of wrapped up and what shuriken is now here are the ways that you can actually get points or stars first off is referrals now down below i've got my referral link so yeah it's going to help me but you get in there use that referral link link that to your shuriken hub which then gives you a referral link which then means you can get more points it's that social five ponza nomics referral codes that we've seen time and time again now the next way to get stars is by trading regularly now by trading regularly it is going to be daily and the daily thing adds to the streaks the same way that you see streaks on something like snapchat or um those social media platforms the idea here is that if you are trading daily you then start to build up your streaks which then lets you get to the different levels get more stars and then essentially get more points more airdrop now the other way is volume by actually pumping through volume but i think this kind of goes without saying the more that you trade in terms of volume the more stars that you'll get which will then lead to more points so that is a quick overview of what you can do to actually get the stars but how do you actually set up the bot if you actually click on the link which is my first a link it'll take you over to telegram what you then do is hit this little burger icon or you could also hit forward slash start and this will essentially start you through the process what you're going to do is you're going to hit forward slash wallets you then hit create soul wallet give your soul wallet a name now with the private key it's best that you import this into a phantom wallet um, but i'm going to de delete this right now and just continue with the tutorial so what you would do is you would copy this address, buy some Solana on an exchange like Coinbase or wherever you get your um, sort of Solana from, then transfer it to this account. What it will then do is then um, pop up in your account. And what you can essentially do is just hit forward slash wallets again. And this will then tell you how much soul you've actually got in your account. So that's how you load up your wallets. Now, before you start trading, it's good to do some settings. Some of the settings that are already in there are fine. So you hit the burger icon but these settings will just make your trading a little bit easier. So with trading, um, hit forward slash settings or trading, and then you can preset the amount of buy values, sell values, slippages, etc. I haven't changed this. I've just changed the buy values to 0.1, 0.5 and one soul just so I can go 0.1 for pray and spray and one soul when I want to actually just actually move in on a trade um, and then usually I leave all of these priorities and slippages as is you need you need high slippage when you trade meme coins otherwise you might not get your trade through now when it comes to trading itself what do you do it's very very simple so over on Dex tools we can see that GME is right up top it's trading uh, it's kind of hot right now it's one of the hot pairs so I'm actually going to copy the address then i'm going to head back to the telegram bot and then once you're here you just hit paste and then enter basically gives you all of the details so it gives you the ticker the address uh market cap liquidity all of that good stuff now a feature that i like is it also gives you your trade uh your sort of your position over the entirety of the trade with the coin and your account so you can see here i've actually done some trading previously um and i'm up 6.6 percent on gme so um the cost is so i've, I've traded like almost one soul worth and then pulled out this much. I think this is good because it gives you an idea of what you've traded um, back and forth and gives you an overview. So when we have a look at this, what we're gonna do is we're gonna buy 0.1, click 0.1, um, and it's this fast, goes through, bang, we're bought. Now, what is great here is that it will also do um, live. So if you actually hit live, 
it will then update this live for you. Now, what I'm actually gonna do is go through and buy a bunch of just different coins to kind of show you what the buying um, and selling, trading, all of that looks like, because I feel like that's really important for you to see how intuitive this is, but also how you can do a decent amount of volume um, relatively easy without trying too hard. So over on Jupiter, we're gonna copy that address and then punch this straight in. Cool, buy point one. It'll give it a second. It'll then tell you what all the slippages, price impacts, all of that. And then it'll be like, cool, bang, bought. Now dog in fire. It's almost got a $900,000 market cap. Paste that in. Um, we can see here, fire, dog in fire. It's got the address, the pools, all of that stuff by point one and then let's go. So you can see here within a couple of minutes, I've just made some buys. Now, this is where I actually really like the tool and it's it's, it's very fun, very intuitive as a tool, especially if you wanna be doing a lot of trading on your phone if you're out and about and you're a degenerate gambler like myself. What you can then do is you hit start um, or the hamburger, hit positions, and then what it'll do is it will then update where you are with it. You then hit live and it'll just essentially keep your balance going. It shows you your entire net worth. So what happens if you sold all of these? Um, it gives you your total balance of what you got available to spend and what your active holdings are. Now I like this because it's like a dashboard. You've got all of your active positions. It, it, it's very easy to navigate and easy, very easy to buy and sell. And speaking of buying and selling, uh, let's just exit some of these positions. So here's what you can actually do is when you're here, just say you're up, so we're up 5%. Um, Technically, we're down because of those previous trades, but you hit GME, it'll then pull up your trade. Then you could hit, you could sell 25%, 50, 75, or sell all. We are going to sell all, and then it will pop up. There we go. So we can see that we actually lost sort of 2% on that trade. Um, so because we're up actually about a percent now what you can actually do is you can hit the pnl this little button here and what it does is it will generate those um images that you get with the profits so you can see here gme sold made six bucks so point uh sort of totally invested 1.1 and total sold 1.16 we're up 0.06 sold up six bucks absolutely killing it uh when we come to the trades and then what you can then do is if you want to actually head back you could scroll back up to your positions if you wanted to um and the thing is the positions they it's it actively updates, it removes it from here. This is a live um, run through. So we'll hit um, fire because this is down 5%. Uh, what we're gonna do is we're gonna sell all here. Um, nice, easy, simple. It'll pop through, it'll be, so it's a 7% loss, is what, is what it is. So now what we can do is I'll actually go to positions just to make it easier. Your feed will get messy, it will get gross. So um, there we go, that is sold for a 0.92% loss. Now your feed will get messy. Um, you can try to delete them as you're going, but if you're trying to trade high frequency stuff, see something on um, X or Twitter, see something somewhere called, it's very easy just copy and paste that address, punch it in and just keep going live positions enter exit and do all of that now just so you have made those 100x gains how can you actually get them out what you do is you hit the uh sort of burger hit head to wallets and what you want to do is export your soul wallet you hit export soul wallet it'll ask you what wallet you want to export um and then it'll pop up with a private key which you can then use to import into phantom or something like that which will then mean that you can then use that as a wallet but then when they build out their solana platform and dashboard which is on the web you should then be able to to sort of trade there a little bit easily and move stuff off and off ramp that sold that you've hopefully made. So that's how you can buy, sell, trade, airdrop farm and get that Solana off your account. Now, earlier I said that I think this is an uncrowded trade and it's a great opportunity. The reason being is that they're in season two at the moment and they're building on the Solana platform. When they were doing it for Ethereum in season one, and I've got some stats here, they had over $60 million worth of volume for season one through their um, sort of platform, but they had 4,000 users with over 100,000 trades. Now this is, this is the uncrowded trade part. They are getting more and more users that want to um, kind of come in, but with such high volume of trades going through, with a token, like we've seen with platforms that actually can generate revenue, if they have a token and it can actually do well, if an airdrop goes out and it's split between 
just say we stretch it out 4,000 and we get another 4,000 soul users. So just say you've got 8,000 users and you've got a very large airdrop in terms of value going to those users, those users are going to get a little bit more. It's better than fighting against 100,000, 200,000, half, half a million users on an airdrop, even if this airdrop may not be as big as other ones, the fact that there are less people in here makes it it makes it a little bit easier. But then also throw in the fact that it's a Telegram trading bot, which means that you can literally be on your phone. You don't need to touch a computer and you can actively trade to keep your streaks up, hopefully make some money, but essentially copying and pasting some things in a trade. I've been trading between, I think I've put in around one and a half Solana, so I kind of go up and down with my trades. I pray and spray just a little bit, but the idea here is I'm getting a lot of volume up in preparation for what could be an airdrop. I'm not throwing all of my time, all of my money, all of my attention, but it's very easy to open it up, use it and um, use it and abuse it. And I do think this Telegram bot is very fun to use. It's very intuitive, it's very easy. And I think that is one of the key parts that I'm making this tutorial is, first off, I would like to airdrop farm myself and part of that is the referral links. But the other part is, it's actually, I feel like it's more intuitive and easier to use than something like BonkBot. And this starts to make, um, especially with the Telegram trading bot, makes it easier for the normies to get on board. You could easily get your um, sort of friends or friends or family that love to kind of dabble or trade or want to do something. You can easily send them a contract address. They can punch it in, they can buy. It's very easy to use. It's very intuitive. Um, and it takes away the hassle of what you expect with a pro trading thing. Now, later on, they are building out their Solana um, sort of dashboard the way that they've got the Ethereum dashboard, and that's gonna be coming out at the end of February. And this gives you a chance to kind of jump in now. Now look, all that airdrop stuff sounds fun. What should you do to actually find those 100X gains and those meme coins to hopefully make some cash while you're airdrop farming? Um, I'm gonna give you some people that I think you should follow, and this will start you off on your journey. The first one is Greeny. He posts a lot of things about, um, you can see used car um, on Seoul. You can see he's uh, trending this down. So this is three hours ago. He's kind of looking at that. He's always posting a lot of content on Solana meme coins, which is great. And he's also got a group as well. When you have a look at some big guys that are big into meme coins, K Money is also big in all meme coins. He makes skits, things like that, but he will talk about meme coins and a bit of that culture. You can then also get into some spaces. Now, some of these spaces on Twitter will be talking about meme coins and things like that. Bunny has a spaces where he talks about meme coins and degenerate stuff. He's got a decent handle on the market and meme coins, what the kids are talking about. So he's also good. But one of these things, it isn't, I can't hand this to you on a silver spoon because the trends and the meme coins move so fast and you need to find these groups of people that then speak about them, follow them, turn on their notifications, find out who's commenting on their things. And then you start to build up a little bit of a hub of people that you understand that trade meme coins, which you can then lean on while you're also airdrop farming. So that's a look at how to farm the Shuriken airdrop and a little bit about how to use their Solana trading bot. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. If you did, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button and drop some love below. I had a pleasure making this video. Hopefully you enjoyed watching it and I look forward to seeing you in the next one.